WandaVision, not the Mind Stone, but Wanda gave Pietro his powers. We finally saw Wanda Maximoff being referred to as the Scarlet Witch in the MCU. This moment arrived in WandaVision, and Agatha did it. Wanda and Pietro Maximoff joined the MCU in Age of Ultron. They were called the Enhanced Individuals back then. It was believed that their powers came from the Mind Stone as a result of Strucker's experiments. While the experiment killed a lot of participants, the twins were the only survivors. At the same time, Marvel couldn't introduce them as mutants. So they did the logical thing by having their powers come from the Mind Stone. But in WandaVision, they planted a seed for a retcon. WandaVision has been given a new insight into this. Wanda always had the Hex Gene. This possibly means Pietro too had dormant powers. We got an answer to the origins of the Scarlet Witch. But what about Quicksilver? Could Wanda be the answer to Pietro's super speed? We saw Agatha taking Wanda back into her memories. Here we see a flashback of the sad night Wanda's parents died. Agatha teases the possibility that Wanda used a probability hex to prevent the Stark shell from going off. But Wanda refutes this claim, so Agatha believes there is more to it. If Wanda unknowingly did create a probability hex around the shell, it proves she always had powers. Now the next memory is where Wanda is in the Hydra lab. We see the Mind Stone going to her. Agatha concludes that the Infinity Stones amplified her powers. No, if Agatha is right and the stone did amplify Wanda's powers, what about Quicksilver? It leaves a giant loophole there. Wanda having some magical abilities or the Hex Gene is what the stone reacted to. But there is no sign of Pietro having super speed as a kid. Also, his powers are not magic oriented. The Mind Stone giving Pietro powers doesn't make sense. An Infinity Stone giving someone super speed isn't consistent anywhere. The Infinity Stones have given multiple characters abilities in the MCU. Carol Danvers got her powers from the Space Stone. Vision got a mind of his own from the Mind Stone. Even the Time Stone gave Doctor Strange some time-bending skills. Thus, powers coming from Infinity Stones make sense. Even in the Scarlet Witch's case, her powers were originally defined as telekinetic, which perfectly lines up with the Mind Stone. But there is no correlation between the Mind Stone and Super Speed. If any Infinity Stone can give such capabilities, it is only the Space Stone. Now it is entirely possible Infinity Stones can give random powers, but this seems far-fetched. Now something which is possible is that the Scarlet Witch gave Quicksilver his powers. It is quite clear now that Wanda isn't fully aware of her capabilities. Wanda is running a big town with illusions running miles. Agatha indirectly confirmed that she has the ability to create life and even alter people's DNA. So this is what she could have done to Pietro in the past. We already have evidence that Wanda's powers can create people with abilities. Monica Rambeau, after passing through the Hex, has some abilities. Wanda didn't want to do this, but it just happened. Same goes for her children as well. It is entirely possible that Wanda gave Pietro some powers subconsciously. Thus, he was the only person to survive the Hydra experiments other than Wanda. Now if this theory comes true, this can explain how mutants can be a part of the MCU. This can also make the Scarlet Witch the most important MCU character going forward. Really? Really? Yeah. Marvel can finally use X-Men characters, and this can be a possible introduction point for them. However, it is more likely that a small number of mutants have been hiding in the MCU all along. Wanda's powers could activate the dormant X-Gene these potential mutants have. Now this can help Marvel introduce classic X-Men characters and link them to the MCU. The events of WandaVision will lead into Doctor Strange 2 as well, so the multiverse theory can't be ruled out too. This could pave the way for Wanda and Pietro being the first mutants in the MCU. Wanda can further expand mutants through her chaos magic. This can be the perfect way to tie up all the X-Men storylines with the MCU. But Marvel has always surprised fans. Let us see what they have in store this time. What do you think about this theory? Tell us in the comments! And make sure that you like and follow us on Facebook and subscribe to us on YouTube for more exclusive content. Thanks! We'll see you in the next one!